School board members at Hamilton Southeastern schools tonight are suggesting changes to the dress code. Our Karen Campbell today spoke with some parents who shared they've got some concerns. Hamilton Southeastern school students may soon have to change the way they dress to go to class and school events. On Wednesday, school board members discussed potential changes to the school's handbook. I've seen it firsthand where there are situations that need to be addressed. Some changes include forbidding students to dress in clothing that would, quote, substantially interfere with a teacher's ability to conduct a class or activity. No spaghetti straps, no baggy pants showing underwear, and shorts, briefs, or slips must be worn under all dresses and skirts. I'm not sure who's going to be checking to be sure that my daughter has a sh pair of shorts on or has appropriate underwear under her pants. Um, however, I am, it will not happen and I will not allow it. Mom Stephanie Hunt is among parents who aren't happy about the proposal. My issue is I want the school board to go through the proper channels and the proper steps before forcing through agendas that they come prepared to address. Another potential change, students must not wear a hood from their sweatshirt on their heads. If caught, that sweatshirt would be confiscated. It is important to me as a mom and as a mom with neurodiverse children that whatever policy we put in place is fair and equitable for everyone involved. Board member Suzanne Thomas saying kids should be their authentic selves to a degree. But we also want to make sure that they are ready to go in the classroom to learn and to focus and pay attention in the classroom. The proposal will be up for a possible vote on July 26th in Hamilton County. Karen Campbell, 13 News.